In this video, I want to show you how to detach audio and also how to group that audio file with the video that it was detached from. So let's go ahead and get started here. As you can see, I have a video clip here that has audio and the audio is obviously attached to the video because it is in the same uh, track here. That's why you can tell, okay? Let me go ahead and make it a little bigger. So this is within the same track. Now to detach the audio, go ahead and select the video. If you have multiple clips, you can select the multiple clips. I just have one long uh, video here. I'm gonna right click and if you go all the way up here, you're gonna see an option that says detach audio. We also have uh, the shortcut control alt D. That's gonna be how you uh, detach the audio using shortcuts if you're a person that likes doing that. Now go ahead and click that and uh, this is gonna detach your audio here, right? This makes the audio track a little bigger. Now you can see that now you can visually see your audio a lot more. So if you're trying to cut through this, uh, you're going to be able to do it easily by uh, seeing, you know, the different dips and the different uh, peaks here, right? So let's say, you know, you were editing your audio here, editing your video, and you're looking at your audio here, and you're cutting the video, right? Say I cut the video, but you also want to cut the audio here, but the audio is not going to get cut because it is detached from uh, the video. All right, so let me go ahead and undo this. What you can do is you can actually group, uh, once you have them separated here for, so that you can actually see the audio, you can group uh, these two here. So what I can do is I can uh, select the video, hold control on my keyboard, and select uh, the audio here. This is gonna select both files, or you can click anyway, anywhere uh, outside the tracks and drag on both tracks, and this is gonna select both files. Now, once you have them selected, go ahead and right click and you're gonna go ahead and uh, hit a uh, group here. Now, this is gonna group these into one group, right? So as you can see, I'm not gonna be able to move uh, the video without the audio or the audio without the video, okay? So you can see these are grouped together. So if I was gonna uh, go ahead and split this or hit split, you can see that it's gonna give you a prompt here that's gonna ask, hey, do you want to group the split clips or you don't wanna do it? Right. So if you want to keep the group, which is what I recommend, go ahead and hit keep uh, the group. Now, this is going to split uh, both here. So if I split this here, it's going to give me the same thing again. If you don't want to see this, go ahead and hit don't ask again. But if I was going to hit ungroup, this is going to ungroup uh, these clips here. As you can see here, this is going to ungroup them. Right. The ones that I split off of here. Right. That's what you want to avoid. You want to keep that group. You know, if you. Um, you know, if if this audio and the video go together and you want to keep that, you don't want them to be out of sync, you're going to want to make sure that they are grouped, right? Now, to group these, go ahead and you can just select, let's say I wanted to group these middle ones. Go ahead and hit uh, group. Now, you also have the ability to ungroup these. Let me go ahead and group these as well. So, if I was going to ungroup these middle ones here, go ahead and right click on them and go ahead and hit ungroup here. There we go. Right, these are now ungrouped. So if I was going to select just one of them, I'm going to be able to move uh, the video without the audio because these have been ungrouped. All right. Now that is pretty much it. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys on the next video.